Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, real quick message. We got to stop letting our children be raised by the television. I was just thinking to myself as I was doing my schoolwork here, how far behind I am on what's really going on in life because I was raised by a television. I guess my parents, they did the best that they can. And I'm not trying to, you know, take away any great efforts that they have made toward me because it did help me become the man that I am. But at the same time, if we knew better, we would do better. And parents, we have to stop allowing the stuff that's indoctrinated within the lines of the television screen to be introduced into our children's minds because they are not learning the truth. They are not learning what's really going on. They have no idea about the magnetism that runs through the earth, how it's good to walk around with no shoes on so that you can be grounded in the earth. They don't have any idea about what's really going on, and nor do they even care. They don't realize that they're living inside of an invisible prison. Nobody wants to be preached to. Nobody wants to take the time to really learn what's going on. And the Bible says, the food shall perish from lack of knowledge. And it sounds great for a t-shirt, but it's so true, it's so telling, and it's exactly what's going on right now. I got to get back to my schoolwork. I just want to say, we could be so far ahead if we will just put down the social media, if we will just put down the television lies and programs, because they programming you not to give a damn about your fellow human being. All those people at that Travis Scott concert smashing and stomping on each other. I don't want to say too much on that, but it was a whole lot of damn fools in that audience. Now, some of it's their fault, some of it's their parents' fault. A whole lot of it is the media's fault. And it's definitely the fault of these damn governmental institutions. The Democrats got you thinking it's the Republicans. The Republicans got you thinking it's the Democrats. When they all eating out the same pot. We have to rise up in our own communities and start working with each other. This grassroots effort to get America back has to start in our own neighborhood, in our own backyard. Men, get it together. Understand that these ladies out here, they doing the best that they can, but they ain't meant to be the leaders. You are, brother. Remember that. Remember that you are a king. That you are a lion. That this system, it has suppressed your roar. And it's now time to wake up, get prepared, and know the war is at your doorstep. We can't afford to be asleep any longer. I want to salute you. I got to get back to the schoolwork. Take care.